so just doing like a little like chill vlog day nothing too crazy hang on if you want i'm making some uh ginger cookies i haven't never made ginger cookies before so i'm sure it'll turn out just fine but molasses oh my god it smells like nasty i never used molasses before but these are my cookies that i'm about to stick in the oven and i gotta roll some more in sugar this dough is really like sticky i just washed my hands so i can put that tray in the oven These are the finished cookies. They're still cooling off. But you can see like the little sugar sparkle on top. These should be really good. They're supposed to be soft ginger cookies. They're worried. It said two and a fourth cup flour, but the dough wasn't really holding together. So this was my experiment, basically. If for some reason they don't hold together, I think I would up the flour just slightly, maybe to like two and a half cups. Look at Miss Pickle. She's my uh, chef support over here. Are you a good girl? She likes to sit on the step stool, but she won't get up on the counter because she's a good girl and she knows better. Right? That's a good key. Yeah. Okay, so I have these on this cooling rack since they got firm enough to, uh, so these look perfect. This one got a little, a little bit of searing on the edge, but not too shabby. <laughs> these are other ones that came out. <laughs> I want to say, so these pans I use, I love these cookie pans. I got them like three years ago at Menards on Black Friday. It was a three pack of them for ten dollars. They're like these commercial grade cookie sheets, and they're like the best damn cookie sheets I've ever had. Also, in the same trip, I got a three pack of these cooling racks for like six bucks, I think. Look, it's Chef Pickle. Chef Pickle. She's a good girl. Chef Pickle. Hi. Oh, Chef Pickle. You give mommy uh, support, right? <laughs> okay, so I'm making some peanut butter cookies, but it's a little bit different. So ignore the fact that I have water in this because I'm cleaning it out to recycle, but I'm using this, which was like the perfect amount of peanut butter for a batch of cookies. This is honey cinnamon peanut butter. So. So, I'm going to doctor this up to be honey, cinnamon, peanut butter cookies. So, I'm going to add a little more cinnamon and some honey to it as a little experimentation. Okay, so these are my cookies before I bake them. Put a little sprinkle of sugar on each one. That's what the dough ended up looking like. There's just like maybe another pan's worth. And I end up putting about a tablespoon of honey in there. And couple teaspoons of cinnamon so these are my ones that just came out of the oven I accidentally hit my finger on that whenever I was taking it out with the glove so kind of smooshy they're super soft so I gotta cool off a little bit before I can throw them in the cooling rack I have my last bit in there and I'm about to have my therapy appointment so it's cutting it close I finished my therapy appointment can you tell <laughs> I'm a little emotional uh, that is my buzzers. I use these for my EMDR. If you don't know what EMDR is, it uh, uses bilateral stimulation. Now usually it's eye movement, but I use buzzers because tactile stuff is better for me than... Um, I, I just can't concentrate with the eye movement thing. Also, it's a lot easier. I bought this thing, okay? <laughs> it was $150. <laughs> this is the exact same thing my therapist has, but it's worked out for COVID because everything's online now 
So we do our video thing and I use my buzzers whenever she tells me to use them and we process trauma stuff. And it can be kind of heavy sometimes, but it's definitely, um, you know, if you have PTSD around things, it's definitely helpful. It takes time. It's very emotional, but it, it can be effective. You just kind of have to commit to it too. Do I look rough? Uh -huh. A little bit. I'm tired. My eyes are puffy. I'm less sad things. Here's pretty kitties. They sleep. Hi, baby. Hi, Pickle. It's a sleepy girl. You're a pretty girl. Yeah. My hands smell good. <laughs> You're my pretty girl. And then Dewey. Hi. She's a vocal girl. Oh, are you being sweet? Oh yeah. You never know with her. She's a moody Judy. Oh. This is the content you want, right? Some kitty. Oh, no. No booty hole. We don't need that. That's not appropriate. This is not your OnlyFans. Come now. <laughs> She's like, Mommy, but I want to show my booty. No, you are not appropriate. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> See, I tell you, she's vocal. She likes to start shit. I swear. Oh, oh! Now she's sweet, Dugan. Oh, I love when she gets like this. She gets all purper and sweet, Dugan, and she likes a noogle on me. Oh, she said. Oh Lord, she said. <laughs> I love when Doogie gets all sweet beanie. Like I said, she moody Judy, so sh she'll flip on you quick. That's just that torty life. Anybody got torties? No, they, they got a little, they call it tortitude. Yeah. Go ahead, clean yourself. It was cute. Noogle your head. No. No. Mm, baby. She is mommy's baby, though, for real. She loves me. Uh, she's lukewarm on, on Brayden. <laughs> That's because he likes fighting with her. <laughs> He'll admit it. He, he he likes to play with Doogie and he gets her irritated. And the right Miss Thing. Hi, Pickle. Are you cleaning yourself? You give me a lick and a boop? Oh. She baby. So I guess Pepsi just started doing this like not too long ago. It's called Pepsi Coin. And so any like Frito Lay snack or Pepsi product you can get cash back on. So I've already made two dollars back and it pays you out at every dollar, so that's not too bad. <laughs> and this was from stuff my boyfriend bought. <laughs> So I'm eating one of the peanut butter cookies. I already ate one of the ginger cookies. Actually, I ate two of the ginger cookies. <laughs> I like the ginger cookies. They turn out really good. These aren't too bad. You can definitely smell like a little bit of cinnamon, though like I could use more cinnamon personally. I love cinnamon though. Like, they're super soft.
you definitely get like a little bit like a hint of the honey and cinnamon but it's not overwhelming and you definitely get more of the peanut butter taste which i'll say peanut butter cookies aren't like my favorite cookie they're easy to make a lot of people like them hello stop being blurry i'll say a lot of people like peanut butter cookies I'm one of these people where peanuts, like, I don't know, it just makes my mouth feel really dry really quickly. So, like, I can only eat, like, one peanut butter cookie and I'll be good for a while. So, these are more likely cookies that I'll end up sharing with other people because my boyfriend's the same way. But I was just playing around. I like to share cookies, so I'll see if, um, I'll probably bring them to work. Like, I'll separate them out into little bags of, like, two cookies. Because, you know, COVID, people, I don't want people to be paranoid. I'll wash my hands like I always do. And I'll divide them into little individual bags so each person can have a couple cookies. And everyone loves when I bake big, big treats at work. So I got a box from Walmart. Look how long this is. <laughs> Why? <laughs> and mostly just got like household items. Pickle. She being a baby. Oh. But yeah, see this? I got like some old chew logs from the rats. Um, some more almond flour. You know, dental picks and Q-tips. Like nothing fancy, but Jeebus. So, <laughs> it's like the next day. I worked a 12 hour shift. I just got home. I was gonna like record more stuff yesterday, but my boyfriend had a rough day at work and so he uh you know I just we talked through a lot of stuff and I was helping cheer him up and I made dinner and I made some nice subs or club sandwiches and just chill out with him before I had to work. It's the pickle boop in my butt. Oh she's happy I'm home from work. Pickles, you want to say bye? You want to say bye, Pickle? Pickle! No, you're not going to talk for everybody. Okay. Well. Like I said, that's, uh, that's everything for this one. Just a chill. He's <laughs> back to pooping my butt. <laughs> anyway, he's so scared of me because I was running shit.